Hello, this is David G, and welcome to this week's Life Tools. Pain is a reality in our lives. Physical pain, emotional pain. And there are a couple of ways that we can cope with it. There's uh, basically two ways that I'd like to suggest. One is the traditional, well, let's meditate, or let's place our attention on something else. When we can drift our attention to something else, we know awareness is everything and what we drift our attention to blossoms and blooms and what we drift our attention away from diminishes and dies. But if there's a deep-seated pain that keeps coming back and maybe you're ruminating on it or maybe it just won't let itself go, I like to follow the guidance of the American Buddhist nun Pema Chodron who teaches us to sit with it. Can you sit with it? It goes back to that uh, Lao Tzu quote. Essentially, can you remain unmoving until the right action arises by itself? It starts off with, do you have the patience to wait until your mud settles? But it's that second part, can you remain unmoving until the right action arises by itself? And Pema suggests, sit with the pain. I would add to that, maybe visualize it, uh, see it in your heart, uh, see it for something, some geometric shape, or see it in some physical form, having a color, having either sharp edges to it or rawness to it, and sit with it. And the tears will flow, and perhaps you stick with it a little longer, past your comfort point, continuing to sit with it and ultimately as you become more familiar with the look the feel the smell the sensations that this pain creates it starts to have less control over us and we are the masters of each moment so if we can allow ourselves just to sit with the pain and chew on it nibble on it and let it slowly dissipate then it has less power over us in the next moment. So there are two paths. Either drift your attention elsewhere or go right to the core and sit and sit and wait and allow and feel the feelings, appreciate the feelings, understand your emotions even at a deeper level. Keep meditating. Keep choosing to either meditate, to move away from your pain, or go deeper to its core to dissipate it and allow you to take the power back from that pain. From the sweet spot of the universe, this is David G, and I'll see you in the gap. Namaste.